Hello, my name is Marcus Ruiz Evans, founder of the CalExit Movement. I want to send a special message for all California citizenry living in America, living abroad there. The last few years have been tougher than any of us could have ever imagined. During that time, you have played an essential part in California's effort to tackle racism's rise in America during the Trump presidency. And I want to thank each and every one of you now that the election for 2020 is over. Donald Trump was defeated in the 2020 election in a large part because of thousands of Californians who moved abroad to the nation of America and turned many American states blue there with their movement. We have all been reminded this year, perhaps more than ever, just how big a contribution you make to California by living in America as you have. Although you live in America as a Californian and as the leader of the CalExit movement, I want you to know that together as Californians, we are friends, family, colleagues, and neighbors, even if you move to America. Together, we still are California. Me and many other Californians are so proud and so grateful you have done us the honor of making your home here at one point in California and of taking our California values abroad to share with American Americans over there. Because California is already your home, I don't think it should be necessary to apply to protect the rights you already have to live, work, and study here in our nation of California. However, because of the continued dissolution of any functional norms in American government, there is now a visceral, if not official, requirement for you to make known your intent to return to California in the event that America ceases to function as a functional government by Western standards or any reasonable standards. America is now a place where one party will call into question an entire election and suggest that there is massive voter fraud and attempt to cause a soft coup because they don't like the fact that they lost and their person is not going to be president again. This party is called the Republicans. However, America is also the place where one party will rig a primary election to make sure that the candidate backed by corporate interests is chosen over the candidate who's more popular with the people. Lesser well-known is the fact that Political Magazine, one of the most respected political news sources in America, has admitted that, in fact, the Democratic Party rigged and manipulated and lied and cheated in the Iowa primary so that Senator Sanders would not win and Joe Biden would. It's now known. America is a place where one party will call for national unity and healing and then have a top campaign aide in public refer to the other party as a, quote, bunch of fuckers, end quote. America is a place where one party will encourage its members to actually store weapons and stand by to engage in violence and usurpation of the government, if called upon. Many of you have already let it be understood through your posts on social media that if California leaves America because America can no longer provide a functional democracy, you want to move back and become part of California again. And you have secured your status as a California nationalist by doing this. But many of you haven't yet made a public declaration such as this, and that is the main reason for my message to you. I understand that the talk of California secession seems fantastic and far off. But if you were living in a country where a region as large as Texas says that they want to secede simply because they don't like who was elected, then you are living in a failed state on the verge of total collapse politically. This sort of behavior where massive swaths call into question the legitimacy of an election and threaten to break up America simply because they don't like the choice of the election is a country that won't be stable much longer at all. A review of banana republics and failed states around the world and how they operate will prove that America is now in a class of nations with how it handles elections, a class of perpetually teetering on the brink of revolution or collapse nations. That's who America's part of now. And this election has shown us that, boldly. The California Secession Movement wants you to make it known now that you are declaring your California right of return if America falls apart and ceases to function the way Western governments should. And if you know other Californians who are in the same position as you, living in America as it slowly melts down, please encourage them to make their intent to return to California or right of return to California statements known now. Fundamentally, our message is a simple one. Because California is a better place with you living here. California is your home. You are welcome here and we really, really want you to come home if you feel unsafe at any time in a clearly failing USA.